Hey everybody, this is Brandon from Sparksmith. I uh, wanted to drop a quick line, latest update on the 2.0 grill bars. These are the latest samples that just came in from UPS a few minutes ago, and I'm gonna show you the differences between the first pre-production samples that we got um, compared to these latest versions. The first ones that we got, we got them like the first week into June, and build quality was really nice. Um, very pleased with the overall design of the product, but they just weren't bright enough. I was like, people are gonna be disappointed with these. It's just, that that's not good enough. Let's try again. Um, and Dan and the folks at XK Glow agreed with me. They are like, okay, yeah, these are not bright enough. Um, I don't know how well the camera will pick this up, but I'm gonna light up the first run version and show you just kind of Um, you know, I don't know if the camera can pick this up, but like, you can see individual chips here. Like you can see spacing and it looks like I had braces or something. I was like, that's not good enough. We gotta, either we gotta redo the chipset or something. Um, turns out they were just being ultra conservative, um, on the amount of power they're running through these, um, chips. And I took this one, the, the first batch bar and I put it on my bench top power supply and I cranked it all the way up to like 32 volts and it just never got any brighter. So they've got software in here preventing these chips from running at their maximum brightness, which is a good thing because if you run them at their maximum power, they're going to fail sooner. So if you stay below that maximum threshold, you're gonna get longer life out of the chips. And so that was their goal. Uh, what we told them was, okay, well, that's great, but can we crank it up a little bit more and how close are we going to get to that threshold before we start to increase the risk of failure because reliability as i've said from the beginning is a paramount concern with these bars um now holding them side by side again i hope the camera can pick this up i'll see if i can work some still shots into this because i know the still shots actually showed the difference the top one is the latest version where they cranked up the power a little bit and the bottom one is the first try version um Overall, I'm very, very happy with where we're at. I think that we have reached a final design on these 2.0 bars. So what that means is if Dan and I can come to an agreement and say, hey, yep, this is it, then they will do a full first batch run of, oh, they made the amber brighter too. Um, we'll do a larger batch of this with the brighter um, power setting and we'll start getting these into the hands of people so that they can test them out in the real world get some feedback make sure it's a good product and a good value for you and we'll be on to the 2.0 bars in very short order thanks for tuning